Stoughton High Field Hockey looks to use its team speed to make a run towards a fourth straight postseason berth. Stoughton has a strong core of returning players, led by captains Jackie Evangelista, Lisa Ramanowskis, Cameron Oliveira, and Haley Bushlow. We caught up with the captains and coach Dan Mark to preview the upcoming season. My outlook this season is that we're going to have a lot of speed. We have um, a lot of girls in shape. We worked hard in the off season, so I really think that we're going to step up in um, the speed aspect, and I really think that we have skill on this team as well, so it'll play out. I think we're going to be very successful this season. We have a lot of speed, a lot of skill. We're in really great shape, and I think we have great team chemistry and we'll work well together. One of our goals is returning back to the tournament. I mean, that's always our main goal, but I think like with a lot of new underclassmen coming up, we have a lot of new talent to the team that'll really help us. Well, we got Jackie Evangelista and Cameron Oliveira, both captains and uh, returning forwards, played a lot last year. And then uh, at the back, we have Haley Bushel, did a real good job last year as a junior. And then Lisa Romanoskis who played midfield, and she saw some considerable time last year as well. Jackie Evangelista and Cameron Oliveira are forwards this year, and they work really well together bringing up the field. Um, Lisa is a mid, and she's just very quick with the ball. She handles it very well, too. I think all four of us captains have a lot of experience, and we all work together well. Um, we have Haley Bush, though. She's really good at back. Um, she's great at clearing it out and she's really strong in the backfield. We also have um, Lisa Ramanowska. She's going to be a mid, and she was the past few years. Um, she's really great at keeping control of the ball, passing up to the forwards, and she's just really there for our support if we need her. And we also have Jackie Evangelista. Um, she's on my right side. She's a forward as well, and she's, her speed is what really makes her a great player. I think we're a really great team offensively. We do well getting the ball up the field quickly and passing and dodging the defense and scoring as many goals as we can. I think overall we're like a really fit team. Um, we, have the, we have the speed that we need to get like ahead of the ball to outrun other teams. And I think our offseason work with our conditioning and running is really what will help us. Our offensive game is pretty strong. We have a returning player, Julia Russell. She started last year as a sophomore. Um, she really has that speed, that skill, that she can get us as many goals as we need. We also have Cameron Oliveira. She's an upcoming, she was a captain this year, and she played last year. So we have some returning players that will help us out. Definitely Katie Woodrow. She'll be coming up this year from JV. She's also a junior this year, and she's just really good at attacking the ball when we need her. We do have some girls coming up from JV. There's some seniors that will be coming up, like Mackenzie Hudson. She's really talented at midfield. Um, she's really good at communicating with the forwards and passing up the field. Um, we also will be bringing up probably Alana McCormick, um, Katie Widrow, and Haley Apotheker as well. They all have really great speed, and they're good at communication and passing up the field. Some young contributors are Alana McCormick. She's a forward. She's going to be really fast, like unstoppable. Katie Woodrow as a back, really just knows how to like fight for the ball, doesn't give up a fight, very determined player. And uh, Jordan Lyons, she's going to be in our midfield. Jordan just has that aspect of her that she can just clear it out as she was a captain in softball, so she really knows how to lead a team. Gianna Barbosa will be our goaltender this year, backed up by Kaylee Marinelli. They both look good yesterday, and we had a scrimmage. They both look good, so I think we're all set there. Goaltending, Gianna Barbosa was our varsity goalie last year, and she's really improved this year. She's doing splits on the field, so I don't think we have a problem there. <laughs> we're going to utilize our practice time, and we're just very good at um, using that to work on our skills. Um, we seem very fit this year more than other seasons, so we should be good. Just playing as a team. I think all over the years, I think that's one thing we've always had. You know, no matter how big our squad is, the kids always seem to pull together as a team. I thought we did that last year, and I'm hoping for that this year as well. With not just being great players together on the field, but off the field too, with the team bonding, I think we'll do great and make it to tournament. 
to be together as a team, but not only like play together as a team, but you know, bond as well, because I really think that's a strong part of becoming a strong team and playing well on the field is getting to know each other.